Today I'm going to answer a question from Derek. He asks, should I get sealants? My dentist recommended that I get some sealants, but I'm an adult. I've heard about needing those as a kid. Should I get them? What do you think? Let's Kickstarter. See you at the desk. Welcome back. So we were talking about sealants, and I want to talk a little bit more about the specifics of what a sealant is. So Derek asked me, he had said, I've heard about sealants in childhood. Why am I being recommended a sealant as an adult? And that's a great question. Uh, I occasionally will recommend a sealant for an adult. So here is a picture of a tooth that would benefit from a sealant. It has deep grooves that are not fully fused, and if sugar is eaten or sugary drink is um, sipped, then those grooves can develop a cavity. And what a sealant does is it seals or covers that deep groove, hopefully preventing a cavity. Here's a picture of a tooth where the grooves are fully formed, they're fully fused. There's really no need for a sealant in this tooth, uh, even with sugar being eaten or sipped on, it's very unlikely for that surface to develop a true cavity that will need a filling. Now, uh, another big thing about recommending sealants to an adult is their cavity risk. If an uh, adult is very low risk for cavities, if they don't eat sugar, if they don't sip on sugary beverage, if the fissure that has um, is not quite fused, has not gone a cavity during their whole life, it's very unlikely to get a cavity now. But if the adult does sip on sugary beverage, other teeth have recently needed fillings, then this tooth would be a great one to put a sealant to try to prevent a filling. It's a way for us to do a very inexpensive sealant for you. Now, instead of an expensive filling, relatively more expensive filling um, down the road, now, one of the things Derek was getting at, I think, was my dentist has recommended sealants on all of my molars. Is that a money grab? <laughs> and I thought to myself, have I ever recommended to an adult patient a sealant on every single one of their molars? And I can't think of one. Uh, I'm sure that there are adults out there that have developmental issue with all of their fissures not sealing. Uh, but all that I can recall, it was one of the seven, or, you know, one to seven, or it was <clears throat> all the ones that I can recall, it was just one or two of the molars, not all of them. So if your dentist has recommended to you that you have sealants on your molars, a good question to ask them is, do I really need it on all of my molars, or do I only need it on one or two? Now, I usually can understand when a patient is hesitant to do work because they aren't looking at the same tooth I'm looking at with my eyeball. They aren't able to feel it with the tool. Um, so I will use um, some photographs. I will take a picture of it, like the pictures that I just showed you up here, so that there's no trust going on. You can see it. If you happen to see a dentist that uses photography, you can ask them to take a quick picture. If they can show you, you see this black line here? I'm worried this will get a cavity. I want to do a cheap sealant for you. That dentist is doing you a huge favor. If you'd like to see us in a professional manner, here's our information. Everybody have a great day.